Hello, legends, heroes, and poopy heads. Welcome to the Omni Flash channel, where Omni Flash will take gaming to the next level. Hey guys, welcome back. My name is Omni Flash, and I am your guide to Perfect World Mobile. Many of you are asking, what sacred book should I get as a DPS, as a demon cleric, or as a healer cleric, or as a tank, or a demon barbarian? Today, I'm going to go through and tell you through my perspective as a DPS, as a healer, and as a tank. I've played all three. We're going to go through and I'm going to tell you what books you need to get at the start, at the beginning, what books you need at about level 79, level 99, level 119, and once you get ascended, what books you should be getting, what books you should have gotten by those levels plus we're going to at first i'm going to show you how to get the creator the creator is the premier dps sacred book i do recommend it for every dps no matter if you are a demon cleric if you are an archer assassin blade master uh Volpine. You'll need this as a Volpine. You're, you, do da you do damage. You're kind of a support, but you still need it for damage. First off, a lot of times there will be cheaper Sacred Book pages. If you look in the stall, sometimes the Sacred Book pages are cheaper. For example, they're going for 1. 1,500 uh, coins, right? And you need six of them. So, so that's about 9,000. All right, so for 9,000 coins, it actually is a better deal. If you look at it, the average out, all of the level one books, and if you need to build a big book, like a rank six creator, or rank five, uh, rank five book, or rank six book, you're gonna need all types of level one books. So you can go ahead, start saving up those pages, and they will be cheaper to just buy the buy the pages, which you can combine in a crucible, which will give you random, random rank one books, and uh, you can use those books to create the other other books. Now, this is a special interface that is introduced in the game at about six months in. So, you may not have this interface yet, so it will take you a longer time to create books. This interface comes in about six months, and it will be easier for you to make books. Otherwise, you're gonna have to just go through the recipe and uh, get get the books, uh, create the books one by one. It is important to remember not to do not do not master the books. Do not if you are creating the creator do not master the other books you the smaller books that you make which are parts for the creator once you have mastered a book it is not usable it is not usable for you to craft a higher book once you master it it is gone you have mastered it it has it has disappeared so you won't be able to use that book in order to craft a higher book now we do have several ways to get these pages. If you play the game every day, you get the sacred book pages from almost everything. It, it becomes more common later on in the game. However, there are several ways to get the level one books. For example, there is Divine Valley that happens twice a day, usually at noon and at night. You have to do Divine Valley every single day. At the beginning of the game, you can do Divine Valley once. Near about six or seven months in, you can get up to 2,000 points. You'll be able to re-enter Divine Valley and get up to 2,000 points from Divine Valley. You use those points very strategically. You just go and save up those points until you are almost ready to create the book that you want okay so it's important you if you look at my setup i have five books you start out the game with four books at about seven months in you can get five books but you will start out with four books and it's very important to try to get your four main books and you don't have to get every single book to master 
that's a waste of resources at the beginning of the game. Like I said, later on in the game, you will be getting more books, and during that time, you can start you can start mastering all of the cheaper books for just extra passive stats. However, the sacred books, the four main ones that you want, will want to be rank three and higher. Rank three, rank four, rank five, rank six sacred books have special abilities that only activate when you have them equipped. So as you start out, you're gonna get a few rank one books. Just throw them on. It really doesn't matter which ones they are. The better ones do not have penetration. The better ones is just HP, uh, crit, and just regular attack. Rank two is the same way. No need to get all of them. Just master a couple of them. Uh, it's best to not master the ones with penetration. They aren't actually used. What you want to do is go ahead and just just get ready and and just create your your rank three books because the rank three books is what you really want. With the rank three books, you will be able to start getting special effects. For example, a points musing. A points musing is a terrific book. It's a great PvP book that will last you even a year later. Right now, I still use a Poets Musing for, I use Poets Musing for Guild League. I use it for any anything that requires PvP. It will just prevent you. If someone's attacking you, there's a percent chance that you will actually not get rooted, not get slowed. It's, it's amazing to be able to resist roots and slows and stunts. Poets Musing is great for Guild League. If you have that on there, people cannot push you off the point or pull you off the point. The second book that I highly recommend is going to be Mountain Pass. Mountain Pass is a super nice book. All these other books, not super necessary. The books that I'm equipping are the books I recommend you to make. If you have the other books, they're okay, but they're definitely not absolutely necessary. Mountain Pass is a great book just to have. It does get replaced in the future. However, this Mountain Pass will be one of your four books until you have enough uh, resources to get the Creator or to get Moonshot or Rouge and Red Lips. You will actually want to absolutely have Mountain Pass. And Poets Musing is sort of an optional book. Only get Poets Musing if it's if you're interested in PvP. In order to save resources and if your focus is on PvE, don't make a Poets Musing. Poets Musing is something you make if you are focused on PvP. Now, after you have Mountain Pass, definitely want Sun Sunset Tales. Sunset Tales gets you 3% crit. Uh, that, that book can be used for a very long time. A year later, Sunset Tales can still be used for all classes. So Sunset Tales can be used for healers, DPS, and tanks. Appetites of Spring is a DPS only book. You can skip Mountain Pass if you're DPS. Skip Mountain Pass and go directly for Appetites of Spring. Healers and tanks don't need Appetites of Spring, but Appetites of Spring is an incredible DPS book, especially for just being ranked 4. You would want to pair up the Numa card, the free Numa Hydra Numa card, so that the Hydra dot, the damage over time, will also proc Appetites of Spring. South of the River, South of the River is a healer book, but do not make it until you have made Endless Waves. Endless Waves is the primary, the best healer book out there. You need it, it will make you twice as strong as a healer. Battle Tactics is a good book for both tanks and DPS. It doesn't actually help you tank, but Battle Tactics is good for DPS and your tank doing some DPS, even in tank form, will help the dungeon go faster. Succubus is a free book if you spend money. So you get it from Dragon Finder. 
it is a bad version of battle tactics so you don't really want to level up succubus succubus gets replaced really fast you can just sort of stick it there until you have a better book rose thorns is an all-purpose book i love it for all for all classes it will reduce the cooldowns of your best skills it reduces the cooldowns of all your skills it is excellent for healers it is excellent for dps it is excellent for tanks well not so good for dps it is a, a place map it will be a okay okay rose's thorns is an okay book for dps you will want to replace it with a creator and rouge and red lips now uh you, you see i still have sunset tales there sunset tales gives you three percent crit it's uh crit is so important and three percent crit is a lot of crit and it just most other books can't compare to it also you can level up you can level up level three books rank three books a whole lot easier than you can level up level four rank four rank five rank six books all right so what we have is rouge and red lips which will increase your critical damage so sunset tails increases the chance of crit rouge and red lips increases the damage when you crit it is 30 percent there is a, a harder to get however not impossible to get book it's called moonshot so in your career you have to decide whether or not you want to get rouge and red lips now there is a problem because rouge and red lips is sort of like a book that you can get maybe three months down the line all right so ever since you start playing you can get rouge and red lips probably in three months or you go ahead skip rouge and red lips get the creator get the creator i'll link i'll link below a video on how I, you can get moonshot moonshot is a book that is upgraded it is an upgraded version of rouge and red lips however moonshot is a book that you may not be able to get for about seven or eight months seven months about seven months is when it's released but yeah creator is an amazing book i swear creator lets me do about 20 percent more damage than i usually do you put on the creator and my creators are only rank are only leveled up to four but you will want to make the creator all the way up level five now earth celebration is a pretty good book early on because earth celebration is bugged for the first part of the game it's uh it's recently unbugged but before then earth celebration not only increased the damage for normal attacks it also increased the damage for skill attacks right now after they have fixed the bug earth celebration is pretty bad it is trash no one uses it anymore however until i don't know about nine months ten months down the line you can still use earth celebration because it does it does pretty good damage because it's bugged and you can actually uh it will actually deal more damage even on skills the divine protection book is is actually from realm war you get it from realm war shards i recommend that you do not get this book however if you do get it what you will want to do is equip it on the plus one skill slot so you will want to get either form duo or form trio be sure to get form duo or form trio if you don't get form duo or form trio if you get form of unity you will not be able to get five books only way to open up and have five books is to have form of trio and form of duo so that's important tears of red allows you to res yourself once every about three minutes now it's not entirely necessary if you get a goblin it can prevent you from ever dying a goblin will just make you almost immortal plus if you do take fatal damage a goblin will prevent you from dying for the next three seconds so that you have enough time to get out of the way and heal yourself up so you can get a goblin 
and instead of using Tears of Red, you can use another DPS book, or another healer book, or another tank book. Battle Tactics is a great book. It will last you for a very long time. I am still using Battle Tactics in, uh, in my tank build and in my DPS build. Battle Tactics is not a good book for healers. Don't get Battle Tactics if you are a healer. Uh, Rouge and Red Lips is what I got. It is a cheaper version uh, than, than Moonshot, but I am going to link below a way to get Moonshot for about $30. And I'll, 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 I'll show you how to get it in my other video. I'll link it in the description below and in the first comment below. How to get Moonshot, how to get Dreamer. Dreamer is a book that is uh, also, you can get it for about $30. I'll show you how to do it. It's in my it's in my other video. I'll link it below. Dreamer is for healers. Moonshot is the upgraded version of Rouge and Red Lips, which is for DPS or healers. I don't think a healer actually needs a Moonshot and a Dreamer. It's gonna cost too much to level up a healer, a Dreamer, and a Moonshot, they're level 6 books. Level 6, rank 6 books are hard to level up. It costs, I think it's 40, 60, 80, 100. That's how many Archaic Scrolls you need. So you need about 180 Archaic Scrolls just to get it to rank 4. If you have too many rank 6 books, it's a little difficult to rank them up. Alright, so we have another book. Uh, Hidden Dragon is a great PvP book to make your opponent team's healers not heal as well. Uh, Turning the Tide is a tank book. If you, I don't feel like it's super needed. However, if you want to become an invincible tank, if you want to be a tank that the enemy's strongest DPSs can beat at and not dent, then uh, if you want to be just pure, pure, pure wall, you want to be a pure brick wall, pure titanium tungsten brick wall, then uh, you can get Turning of the Tide. Divine Punishment is an okay book. It is also in, uh, in the same way that you get Moonshot. I feel like Moonshot is a better book than Divine Punishment. Uh, some whales do get Creator Divine Punishment. Man Moonshot, and that is for like super super whales, but I think I think the combo of Creator and Moonshot is already really good. Parting Grief is a good book for end game PvP, where at the very if you focus on your build and just if you keep re-rolling and you focus on getting evasion, if you have a strong evasion sigil if you have a strong overlord sigil with 20 percent evasion plus the six percent plus you just have a ton of evasion in your build it can be seriously hard to hit you so parting grief is a nice book only if you have the evasion and the equipments to back it up just to make yourself a ninja all right, that about sums up all of my favorite books. If you have any questions, feel free to ask me. If you like this video, please like, subscribe, smash that notification bell, and comment below to be entered to win a $25 iTunes or Google Play gift card on October 15, 2020. I'll see you in the next video.